Well, even with fewer cars out on the roadways these days, distracted driving continues to be dangerously prevalent, and that includes our youngest drivers. So here to talk about the current laws and some pending legislation regarding teen driving, Attorney Tom Simus of Simus Dramus Law Firm, joining us as he does every weekend. Tom, first and foremost, let's talk about the current rules regarding teenagers and distracted driving out there. Good time to revisit it. Really, we can't do it enough. And when it comes to teenagers and distracted driving, we have a law that is known as Kelsey's Law, and it was initially passed in 2013. And here's what it says. It says specifically for drivers who are issued a level one or level two graduated license, that's that graduated licensing system we have for people learning to drive. If you're at level one or level two, you cannot use a cell phone while driving at all. However, one of the exceptions in the law says that using a cell phone doesn't include when an individual is using a voice operated system that is integrated into the motor vehicle. So sort of what giveth taketh away. Now, one other rule that applies to teenagers and adults alike, everyone, is that no one is permitted to text and drive. But for these youngest drivers, we have this restriction on use of a cell phone. But again, kind of a big exception, especially as we see technology and vehicles having advanced so much over the last few years. Yeah. Obviously, uh, it's hard legislation. Got to keep up with all the technology and changes. What kind of pending legislation are we seeing right now, right now, maybe to strengthen some of these laws? Well, of course, we're getting very, very close to the end of this legislative session. There's just a couple more weeks left. Everyone knows that the legislature has got a lot on its plate this year, particularly dealing with COVID. But there is a, a bill known as House Bill 4181 that would strengthen some of these uh, protections. And the first thing that it does, and this is very significant, is that it would prohibit the use of cell phones in a car for anyone under the age of 18. So it would no longer just be limited to those people who have a level one or level two graduated license, but it would say that anyone under the age of 18 cannot use a cell phone while driving. And then also very significantly, it takes away that exception that we were just talking about. In other words, it wouldn't be okay to talk and drive through one of these voice operated systems that's into integrated into the car. So two very important ways of strengthening protections against distracted driving. Who knows whether the legislature will get to it this session or whether it would come back around next year. But you can obviously see that there are certain people uh, who understand that legislatively, we may need to be doing more technologically and with our laws to keep up with technology to protect people from this epidemic of distracted driving. Yeah, a moving target indeed. Just when you get caught up, something else changes. Hard to keep up with technology. Can't imagine how hard it is for the laws. Tom, where do people track you down? They have more information. Well, they can find us online at www.sinusdramus.com. They can shoot us an email at info at sinusdramus.com. Give us a call in West Michigan, 616-301-3333. All right, Tom, thanks as always. Appreciate it. Thanks, Derek.